Look where we are guys, Catherine. The kids and daddy are in the car because they just want to get into it. So let's just get into it. Click the subscribe, the like, chuck a comment at the end. Let us know what you think. And we're on, let's go. All right, we're on our way to Catherine Hot Springs. This is a beauty, this one. Can't wait to show you guys it. Would you say one of your favorites? I would say because the, the temperature is perfect and it's an easy walk from the caravan park. And yep. there's a few different options. There's a deep pool, there's a like a little shallow pool. Shallow Ooh. pool. Oh, don't don't spoil it all though. We'll have to show you guys in a sec. Crocs in there. Probably wouldn't go swimming in there. Yep. And then down here to the hot springs. And they are pretty hot. I think Matarang is hotter, but this is still pretty warm. Mm -hmm. Just right. It's a beautiful day. It is a beautiful day, mate. How perfect to say that as we're on our way. Birds are chirping. Birds are chirping. The sky is blue. Okay. How is it? Good. Yeah. It's lovely. The temperature is absolutely perfect. And warm. Yeah? Yeah. You're practicing your swimming, buddy? Yep. Yeah. Your goggles? Cool. Let's go. Yeah, you gonna go back? Now you can go down over the waterfall. Good? Uh huh. Yep. Fly over the waterfall. <laughs> so good and surprising that there was pretty much only us and our friends there one other family came that whole time um, whereas about a year ago when we were there it was packed even in the morning there were lots of people during the week if you come here try and get there before kind of two o'clock because then school breaks out and then it fills up with all the kids in the afternoon so if you want to have some peace and quiet get here before school breaks out for sure. Hot tip. Right, 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 right. Sit down. Stop. Hold him in one hand and then Good. Any Oh, I'll target him. All right, you ready to go? <laughs> Almost took your head off. <laughs> Good catch, mate. Nice try. Eh? <laughs> Sorry about that. Normally better throw than that. All right, we're out of here. Heading to Edith Falls. Would you believe a year later we're in exactly the same spot? We haven't had the tent out for a while and all the kids are really wanting it, so we're going to pop it up just here. But they've got to set it up, hey? They've got to set it up. I don't want to stay here, no. Ain't going to keep it low now. If you want to go, let's go. Let's wrap it up and hit the road. I just got an awesome vibe. Striking the wind of hopes now. Liberty's on my mind. We've taken off, we've left the ground. You, you got to... So my dad watches these episodes and he's often saying, eh, but it's too windy. Get one of those things that goes over the bloody GoPro. So I've got one and I'm going to put it on today. So you guys tell me whether this works and you like this with the wind. It's not on at the moment. I'm about to put it on and we'll see if it works. So it's a decent walk just to even get to the start of the walk. 
probably, I don't know, 200 meters or something. I suppose that isn't much of a decent walk, is it? Uh, and then you start and the first part of the walk's uphill and in the sun. And so when you get to the top, you're like, oh my God, get me to this top pool. So it's called the top pool. So you can go for a swim in the bottom pool. We're gonna do that later on with some beers while the sun's setting, which will be awesome. So at the moment, we're gonna go up to the top pool, cool off down up there, then get hot again as we walk back down. Doing it? Doing it. Woo. Watch him. It ain't nice. You can try that at the end. <sighs> this is where we're taking you guys. Jit, jit, jit. In there. Let's cool off. Oh, so pretty. We're going in, worked up a sweat, walking here, so this water's gonna be beautiful. Yeah, baby, how good are these waterfalls? Just love these waterfalls. We remembered them being this amazing and they have disappointed. Even better second time round. When we were new to rock jumping, we were so paranoid the kids were going to get hurt. In this one, I literally throw Ace because I think he's going to hit a rock underneath. Watch this. Oh my god, I'm going to show you that in replay. Okay, look, I just peg him at the water. <laughs> look how excited he looks. And then how scared he looks. Oh, Bubba. Let's do them again. We're all a bit tired after last night because we had mm. a late one. Too many Krakens. <laughs> Fiona and I stayed up very, 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 very late. Yep. So we're all exhausted. And so that's good at a place like this because you have options. You can either do the hiking and you can go up to the top pool and do all yeah. of that. Or if you're feeling a bit lazy, like we are today, we're going on a short walk, which is about 100 metres from our caravan to the big pool. Yeah. Um, so we've just had a cruisy morning. We're going to go here, cool down, and then go back have some smoothies. Or ice Right, we're in this other swimming hole. There's a few different sections that you can swim at at Edith Falls. So we're gonna go over there. And then from there, you walk across a little bit and then you can see the waterfall on the other side. Let's go together. I'm obviously not gonna swim because apparently I can stand. So I'm gonna keep you guys out of the water. <laughs> I'm not sure I can stand. <laughs> Right in! <laughs> yeah. Alright, okay, we're getting there. Kids have beaten us easily. There's a little path to walk through here. This is nice. Yeah. Danny's up there admiring the waterfall. Don't worry guys, I'll show you that in a second. So pretty. Oh my gosh. We've got it to ourselves pretty much. A bit tough on the feet guys. Oh, the serenity. 
We are super lucky because tonight it is a full moon and, and it's going to here. rise. There's nobody here. Yes. So there we've got the place one. to ourselves and it's going to rise over the waterfall. Well, we don't know that. Well, we're <laughs> expecting it. <laughs> we're hoping it will. Nah, somewhere over there. We don't know if it's going to rise over the waterfall. Oh, well, look, it'll be above the mountains somewhere. It'll look good regardless, hey? We think so. <laughs> well, we'll see. Yes. So we brought the blanket down and you know in case the kids get bored. The nice reflections. Oh, these reflections are bloody oh, stunning. Oh, okay, are you ready? Okay, check this out, guys. Look at this. Oh. What do you think, my love? Em's too tired to care after not getting any sleep last night. You guys will probably remember in Bungle Bungles, there was a bower bird and there's another one here. And he's like literally just across the road from us, right? He is beautiful. And if you look at him, the back of his head, he's got like this pink color. Oh, he's closed it. He's closed. You can either open the back of his feathers. Do so you see pink? Oh, there's a girl, there's a girl. A robot when it moves like this, like, mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. like this. I think that was a girl he was trying to court because he was getting annoyed when she wouldn't go through his bower. He's like, Come on, come through my bower. But the girl yeah. didn't destroy it. No. Maybe she wasn't too impressed, but she didn't hate it. Mm. Try and get a closer look at his bower while well, he's distracted. Let's do it. I'm gonna stay back here. Come on, we're gonna sneak around. Sneak, sneak around the corner. Let's go. Green and white, and he's green and white. Look in the bower. Just look. It's so perfect inside. It. Just perfect. Okay, he didn't come back. We got to see his house. Let's go, let's go. Quick, before he comes back. I feel like a robber or something. Okay, okay, okay. Where are you? Off from these balls. See you later, Edith Falls. I reckon okay. the top 10 campground in Australia. Whoa. Big That's call. Massive call. Big call. But nice green campgrounds. You're only a 50 meter or 100 meter walk to the a good swimming spot, or you can go a bit further up to the, the top pools. This is true, this is true. Nice um, clean toilets and showers. Yep. Nice showers. Actually. Drinking water. Good grass. Good grass. Green. Yeah. Only... It wouldn't be my top 10, but it would be up Oh, it's my good. top 10. The only thing is no power, but do without that but yeah. yeah top 10 for me yeah, some good walks around lots of bird life we had like a bower bird bower birds bower just near our van and very good on to the next
Good bloody evening, mate. Now well, that's the park. So excited to go in and show you guys. We love it here. Oh, this is a good spot. It's love amazing. It. It's one of the best hot springs. Yeah, definitely. Yeah, definitely. Look, you're ready to go, aren't you, mate? Yeah. Oh. Geared up and set. Already got his goggles on. <laughs> yeah. You're like, get me in there. Get me in there. Now, this it? is the part that I remember. Last time he was here, he was in for like five hours straight. Mm. And he actually got a bit of a, a sore throat from it. Yeah. Because he was in there that long. So, mm. not five hours today, mate. Yeah. <laughs> and try to keep your mouth closed, buddy. Try to keep like. Keep that mouth closed. <laughs> yeah. So we are here. It's a really short walk in to the pools here. That's where we're going. And then you can do this walk up here as well, but you have to look out for freshwater crocs up here. So this is where we're going. It's you know only a couple of hundred meters to there. hot water coming out of the ground here and it's all bubbling up and that's where all the water comes from. Righto, we're here at Matarenka and we're going to see Nathan Whippy Griggs. Yeah, for the third time. We love it that much. Yeah. But I tell you, he's got a lot to answer for this bloke because all around Australia, caravan parks, there's kids cracking whips and making so much noise. So much to answer <laughs> for. It is, it's like a basketball, like boom, doom, doom, constant yeah. noise. Anyway, um, good on the kids for having a crack. Oh, well, good what on you for having a crack. Uh, so we're excited to go and see him. He's actually pretty funny too. He's like comedian slash amazing whip cracker. Yeah. And also there's a um, person that has to go on the ground. Yes, someone normally gets picked from the audience. Would you like that to be you? No. No? Scary. I wouldn't. <laughs> That's scary. Alright, let's go see it. Woo! <laughs>
This morning we've come to Bitter Springs. It's only about a five minute drive from Mataranka. Uh, it's best to get here early to beat all the crowds and the waters are not a lot stiller then and it's not as murky. So we're coming in here. We're gonna walk up here. It's only a very short walk. Um, and then you basically hop in and you float down to here and then you get out, walk back up and do it again. So it's a lot of fun. Pretty tired though, because the whip show doesn't start until nine o'clock at night. So we didn't get back to the van till 10.30. You know, kids didn't get to bed till like 11. So we're all a bit tired, but who cares, hey? Doesn't matter. Beautiful. Yeah. But I tell you what, you need a pool noodle and enough for the adults because the kids definitely need them. So, well, I definitely needed one too down here. That's em good. and I were sharing it. Good exercise, mate. <laughs> Work, buddy. There's a bit of Audi there that's floating. Oh, it was very, very warm and underwater it looks like there was like a tiny forest and someone put water all over it. It was very pretty. Oh, beautiful. And it's very clear. Good? Too. Yeah. Nice. Definitely bring your snorkel. You definitely <laughs> need some, some goggles. Awesome. Some kind of goggles and snorkels are awesome. Yeah, water is beautiful. <laughs> It feels a bit hotter than Matarenka. Maybe because it's colder outside. Maybe. Uh, just about to leave Matarenka for the third time, I think. Yeah. Yeah, so exactly. we already had our morning swim, a little bit, bit of a late coffee. Late, very late coffee. It's like 10 30, 11. We're yeah. late checking out of here. Running late again. Always running late. Get Always. our money's worth. <laughs> yeah, totally. Yeah, just filling up the water tanks and then we're off. Yep, but we might even park in the day use area. Em and I have had enough swims. We might uh, do a bit of schoolwork because that's more fun than swimming, isn't it? One more Not. swim. Uh, and then Danny and Ass will have another swim. One more swim. And then we're off. Yep. Uh, we are at Daily Waters. Love Ooh, it here. Yeah. And I'm pretty sure we are going to smash the pool and some beers. Beef and barra. That was it, Ace. It says, if you touch the cars, bikes, or let your kids play in them, I will find you and put my foot up your Think about that. Oh, that's it. That's what it was, huh? Look at the crocodile. It's upside down. Daily Waters is pretty much all about just like eccentric stuff. So there's this junkyard with heaps of crazy stuff. Uh, there's a saltwater crocodile. It's just like in someone's front yard. A horse was just walking down the street with this guy that um, goes around on like a scooter. There's bras and people's junk just hung, hanging up all over the place. You leave stuff there. It's just eccentric. Daddy, Daddy. Definitely worth a visit. And of course, beers in the pool. And they have a really good food here too. So. Oh, it's almost half hour. Okay, we've got to go. Let's go. We've got to get to the bar.